introduce uh, Chuck, Chuck Conway over here. Uh, he's he's squatting down. <laughs> is uh, the manager of this, so he runs the day to day, along with Matt over here on the side, Matt Sanders, um, and then James and Dakota helpers. So these guys are running the day to day. Uh, Chuck's been here over 30 years, so I don't really have to. I'm learning from him, <laughs> so actually a lot. But uh, the oil's new for us. You know, my dad, my family's got a lot of heritage in the oil industry, and I, I have dodged that till now, and, and it's here. So i um, praying that the, that the market picks up. But if we had the opportunity here this summer presented to us to, to buy it, and the price was right, and the opportunity looked like it was just right for us. So, so we uh, dove in head first, and, and here we are. But, uh, uh, guys are doing a good job running day to day. We're, we have tried to make as little changes as possible so the customers don't really notice uh, anything different. Um, more of the changes have been internal, uh, doing our computer automated system with tickets so there's no more paper. Uh, they keep a history everywhere they go so before they drive clear out to Garden City or Liberal they can look up and see what's at the location before they leave here so they can take the right stuff, you know, horsepower, motors, all that good stuff. Um, we're automating it as far as GPS locations. So, you know, when they tell me go to the wagon wheel and turn right two miles, like I, yeah, I, I hit a button and it takes me to it. So, so, so that, that's gonna be a big help. But uh, uh, automate the inventory so they know uh, with the click of a button exactly what they have in stock here. And, uh, so anyway, those are some of the changes that we're doing, but, but really in all, just trying to make it as minimal of an impact as, as possible to the customer. So but that's about it. And I didn't introduce my wife. So my wife, Kim, my partner in crime. So. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I better keep introducing Jennifer is uh, our office. Uh, she does all the billing on the petroleum side. And then Ryan Hammocky over here, uh, the service manager on the Hammocky Electric side, kind of my right hand man fill in everywhere else. So primarily oil filled, uh, some, at, some at agriculture, um, but primarily all the uh, pumping units that you see going up and down in the fields, primarily they're taking care of those. So, you know, the underground power that feeds to it, um, sometimes overhead, uh, they do that as well. Um, the motors, that's what you see all these, the electric motors that are on uh, on the pumping units, you know, servicing those, changing those. Um, the controllers that are on the wells that operate that motor, um, you know, used to be that everything was just a, a big contactor, simple, just hit a button and it closed. Now it's, it's a lot more automated with the variable frequency drives that are out there now that, you know, more efficient, uh, use less electricity, uh, they're less wear and tear on the rods down the hole and on the motors itself. And so definitely got a lot more technical in the last, I don't know, 10, 15 years, something like that. So, so. What's your service territory? The entire state of Kansas. So um, primarily these guys work, it seems like the biggest oil fields, you know, Lyons, Great Bend, and then moving more down into Southwest Kansas. There is some stuff in the east that they haven't tapped into a lot. I'm hoping that our Emporia location can start building that area up out there. So, but right now it's primarily central northern Kansas down southwest. And western Kansas. Yeah, we do, yeah. we do stuff up northwest Kansas also. And northwest Kansas too, yeah. The, the state of Kansas. Yeah. <laughs> so these guys probably aren't normally here then. They're probably all over the No, place. they're chomping at the bit to get out. <laughs> <laughs> I know when I told them we had, they had to wait around until 1030, I think one of them went up to Claflin, and one went down to Stafford this morning. But, but they're, I think they're all end up heading west here uh -huh. in a little bit. So. Yeah. They put a lot of miles on. Yeah, yeah. Very cool. All right. Any other questions?